How you doing today, guys? This is Alex Gomez, your favorite teacher in the whole world. Today, we're going to do surface area. And in this case, it's going to be the surface area of a triangular prism with the base given as a shape of a right triangle. So this kind of looks like a, like a bike ramp, if you want to put it like that. So the first thing that we have to do is identify my bases. So in this case, my base is going to be this triangle right here. And I'm going to draw it on the side and label it. This is a four by three, and these are inches. Now, I am also given this length height, and we're going to need that later on to find the area of the other things. Now, the formula to find the area of a triangle is just area of a triangle is base times height divided by two. Now, this is my base, and I have two of them. I have another one over here in the back. So I have ju two just like it. So the base for this one is just going to be four, and my height is going to be the wall and not the ladder. This is the ladder. I don't need the ladder. I need the wall. So this is three D divided by two. So four times three is 12 divided by two is six. But since I have two bases, it's going to be 2 times 6, which is 12. And these are inches squared. Now, that's for the area of the bases. Now, for the, we're going to have to identify the rectangles that we have. So, one that we have is the one on the bottom. Like, if this is a ramp, this will be at the bottom. And I'm going to draw it on the side. I know it's 10 inches tall and it's four inches wide right here on the bottom. To find the area for a rectangle is just base times height, which is four times 10, which is 40. Now I have another rectangle on the back and it's right here. And I'm gonna draw this on the side. The height is also 10 and the base is gonna be the three right here. Same formula, base times height. So this one is gonna be 30. And the last one that I have is going to be this one right here on top. That's the ramp, the part of the ramp, the top where you're going to jump with the bike. So that height is also going to be 10, but the bottom is going to be 5. Now, these are not to scale. The area is going to be the same. So 10 times 5 is just 50. So if they're asking me to find the lateral surface area, I'm just going to take the area for each one of those rectangles and add them all up. So my lateral surface area, it'll be 40 plus 30 plus 50, which gives me a total of 120 inches squared. That's my lateral surface area. Now, if I need my total surface area, my total surface area is going to be my lateral surface area plus how many bases? Two of them. 2b, which is going to be right here. So this is 120 plus 12. So my total surface area is 132 inches square. That will be it for this one, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. See you next time. Bye-bye.